What is up guys, Awesome Nerd Show here and today we're unboxing the Nerd Block. But this is from last month, the June 2017. Um, and so we finally got it. So this, um, so with NerdBlock, they've been shipping their stuff out late. They've had some problems. They promised it'll be fixed uh, for this month, which we've actually got tracking and stuff like that for July so far. It's a little bit later than they normally do, but they said by next month everything should be on track. But this is for June, and we were supposed to have this two weeks ago now, but there was some issue with um, the shipping address and all sorts of stuff, which by the box everything looks fine. So I don't know if this is a replacement or what's going on um, but we finally got it like I said two weeks after it should have been here um, but let's just go ahead and see what it's, it's inside but first as you can see the box is like completely smashed there's a hole like the box side of the box is ripped out and this was all smashed down and it kind of like stuck it or got it pushed back up and stuff but we believe the theme is badass women and I've not heard good things about this block at all so kind of makes you not um, care about the weight or whatever and stuff, but obviously I paid for it, everything, and I want to get it. Um, but they've, I think they said next month or the August box that um, they've increased the value to like double the price or something. Like they put more expensive items in or something to try and like make up for the delay of the past couple months and stuff. Um, so hopefully it'll be good or decent or whatever. Not exactly sure. Um, like I said, I don't know if it's this next month or August, but or this current month or August. But we'll go ahead and start, and we'll start with the T-shirt. And so we have a Pugsalent shirt, and it's a pug surfing on a pizza on a wave, <laughs> wearing weird uh, pants and heart glasses. I don't know what. I have no clue what this is at all, but it looks really weird. Um, I don't know. I don't know any if this is supposed to be from anything or what. Um, the, I like the collars of it, I will say that. But other than that, I don't know anything about this. But um, weird shirt, but it's it's okay. Um, next up, we have what I, is, I assume is a poster. And I don't know exactly what's on it. Like It looks kind of like some superheroes. Some female superheroes. Um, yeah. They're kind of like teenage girl superheroes. And so it's gonna it's hard to see, especially with this all rolled up. Like it's hard to see who everyone is. Obviously there's Harley, what I assume to be Huntress, Wonder Woman, um maybe Hawk or Batgirl. I was gonna say Barbara Raven. Gordon. Say there's Raven, Poison Ivy, Black Canary. I don't um I don't know who all these women are. Maybe Catwoman here. Um, Zatanna or whatever the girl's name is. I don't know who this girl is over here with the stripes. I don't really know that one. But there's a whole bunch of people on there. Like I said, I don't know if the um, thing will show whoever, or say whoever it is. But it's a neat picture. Like, I don't, obviously I don't know what to do with this. Because um, it's, as it like shows, a girly picture. But I like, though, how they took all the, um, these uh, girl superheroes and put them, um, into like, if they were actual girls or whatever but that's pretty cool like I said it's weird like because I obviously I can't really do anything with it but it's it was the idea was awesome or cool of it next up we have a thing and hopefully it's not destroyed because this is where the box was destroyed so this box but it's a Wonder Woman and it says desk clock um, of course by DC and everything so like I said hopefully it's not broken which it doesn't look like it's anything super special or nice or anything so shouldn't really matter that much but um so if I can get it out of the bag here and of course there's no uh times on the clock so you can't really or numbers so you can't really tell what time it is I mean obviously you can tell by the hands but it's obviously just a Wonder Woman outline that it has like her what would, I assume would be her logo behind it or something and then um it's got a clock obviously clock hands and then there's a thing by keeping but battery in and set the time and everything so nothing nice it's just a piece of plastic and then it's got this base that just it just sits into so nothing nice at all about this um, but if you're a Wonder Woman fan it's you know something you could just stick on a desk or something like behind you just have as a clock so that's um, it's not bad it's something new and different and I like this I just wish it was better quality or something but it's still like I said still pretty decent 
And it looks like we have a couple DC bombshells um, things. So we have the container here. So I'll open it and see if I can figure out how you open this. Um, but we'll see who we got. Like I said, I don't know. I don't see anything saying exclusive on here. So um, I doubt they have like any exclusive uh, figure out of this. But we got a Harley Quinn. And it's, I don't know if it's a special. It's one of the variants. So it is, yeah. We got one of the variants. Because I'll say I've never, I've seen, because I've looked at these before just to see what the um, characters look like. And I was like, this doesn't look like, you know what. So we got like one of the rares. Um, it just shows a question mark on the figure. Um, so yeah, we got one of the um, rare figures. So that's pretty cool that we got a rare out of these sets. And it's a Harley Quinn. And I, I like the way it looks like they look really like short and fat to me but that's just my opinion uh, it looks like there was that and maybe um i don't know who the other oh it's probably wonder woman is the other exclusive or variant whatever so that's cool that we did get a variant and then our last one thing is a wonder woman keychain which this one i'll just leave in the box but it is i can't tell what she's doing oh um so it's again the bombshell wonder woman and just, she's tearing apart chains i couldn't tell what was in her hands but she has um, two parts of a chain in her hand that she's like ripped apart and stuff. So that's a cool like bombshell keychain. I know um, what I'm going to do with this. I got a little cousin that likes Wonder Woman, so I'm going to send that for her and stuff. But um, that's all like not decent. Like I said, I heard horrible things, like not good things about this box, but I don't think it was that bad. I mean, for Badass Woman, it's about what I would expect um, the box to be. A lot of Wonder Woman as. Um, the shirt made no With sense. The, yeah, whatsoever. the shirt shirt does make sense, but that's what. Um, so it looks like we are missing something, but I, like I said, I don't know. I know there's was a problem with I believe something was missing, and they decided just to ship the box. So that's probably the item. Um, I don't know what's going on here. Um, so the item was Wishful Drinking by Carrie Fisher. It's Carrie Fisher's um, biography book. Um, so that's not in here. I, like I said, I don't know if that's what the item was. I just know there was something there was, that had a problem and they couldn't get it. So they just decided to ship the box and stop waiting for it. So I don't know if it was that. Um, so we didn't get that. Then there's the um, Gotham City Street Style, which is the, um, all the girl superheroes. Um see if there's anything it does not it does say oh it says on here so it's do you um, I don't know if we can hold it up of course with it being rolled up it's hard to let's see but it says um, it's got Batwoman so that's the person Batwoman that's who I didn't know Batwoman, Zatanna, Catwoman, Batgirl, Katana, Wonder Woman, Huntress, Harley Quinn, Raven, Poison Ivy, Black Canary, and um, Mera or Mare whatever her name is, is the last one so that's all the characters. So that's, um, like I said, I really like that. I wish, you know, some, I don't know. I still like it. I'll probably do something with it, though. But they did put the um, poster size in here, which is one thing nice, because we always get posters, and they never have the size on it, so always have to measure it, and it's always a problem. Then we got the bombshell keychain, and it says you could get um, Wonder Woman. It looks like Supergirl or Batgirl were the options. Then we got the Wonder Woman acrylic clock, is what they're calling it. And then it shows... So the shirt shows it's an exclusive, and it's a Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2 um, Women of the Galaxy shirt, and it's got Mantis, Gamora, and uh, Nebula, and I'll post the, or hold the picture of it up there. Yeah, that's not and, what we got. Yeah, that's not what we got. So again, I that's why saying after that, I don't know if that's maybe what the problem was. Um, like I said, I don't, I know there was an issue with items, but that's all I can remember. I don't know if they said what type of item or anything. So maybe they just threw in a random shirt or I don't know, or it could have been the book or it could have been both. I don't know. Um, don't know much of anything. All I know is we got our box. That's all I really care about. And the theme for, um, Ju uh, July, which of course this month, which we do have the thing. So we'll be getting it here in a week or so. Probably it says parents, uh, not allowed or no parents allowed is the theme so it's like a tree house type thing or something not really sure um but then that looks like that is it then of course a whole bunch of other little item things to do in the box so bro what was your favorite item out of this box 
Uh, possibly the bombshell minifigure. The Harley Quinn? Yeah. Yeah, I mean, the only reason I like this is because we got, like, a variant or a, a rare one, because you usually never get the rare items out of anything. So it's cool that we, first thing we ever got that, or out of the bombshell things, that's what we got. So that's cool. Um, my probably favorite is going to be the poster. Like I said, I like how they took all the um, characters and put them into a modern day. Um, I just like that idea of it. I don't know what else, like how to say what I think about it. Like I really like it, but I think it's weird at the same time for a guy like me at least. That's just my own personal opinion. And I do like the clock, like I said, the idea of it. I like being able to get an item in a box that's actually useful. Like you can actually put this up and use it. And it's got multiple purposes that you know, a decoration and a clock. Um, I like that idea, just don't like that design. Like, if it actually had Wonder Woman on it, um, it would be a lot better and stuff. But that's going to be it for the Nerd Block. Still have no idea about this shirt. If anybody has any ideas, if this is from anything or if it's just a random shirt, uh, let me know. Um, and, of course, it doesn't say Nerd Block or Shirt Punch or anything where they usually get the stuff, so I don't know. But that's going to be it for this unboxing. So if you enjoyed, please leave a thumbs up. Leave any comments you have down below and hit the red subscribe button to see more. And we'll see you next time.